Step 1. Unpack the XZ file that you will download, okay? And find the image inside and extract it to a place on your hard drive. Step number two. Find the GS. Now, this one we're just gonna copy to the device. So the image that you unpacked, you're gonna copy to the internal of the A40, okay? You need to install Orange Fox, so you cannot do this from out the official recovery. That won't work. Okay, if you don't know how to install Twerp, go to XDA, ask Google or whatsoever how to install Twerp, or look in my video list, and there you should find the video of how to upgrade the A40 from stock to anything out there that works. And in this case, to Android 14. All right? So make sure you have a good recovery installed. I would go for Orange Fox. Okay, it's fully supported on the A40. And that will let you do magic with your old A40 or maybe you have a brand new one. One looking in mint state, always good. This file is 3,500 megabytes, so it takes a little bit to copy. So in this video, you're gonna see the easiest way and the right way how to install a GSI Android 14 to this phone, the A40. We flash in the third step the GSI to the system partition. I selected system as you could see and it's being installed the image to the system of the device. The system partition. We as well have a data partition and in step four as you're gonna see in a second Beautiful. In step four, we're gonna hit the little three stripes there and go to manage partitions. We select data and then we hit okay. And we go for change FS, tap that one and change it to F to FS, okay? Yeah, and then we're gonna go ahead and format data and select type yes. We. Oui. Type we. Oui. And then you can reboot and go wait for it. This is it. This is how to install Android 14 to the A40. Just wait for it. It's gonna give you ta -tum. Ding dong. There she goes. Three. Yes. And in a little from now, it's gonna start showing the Android boot screen, and that should happen and now. There we go. Formatting of the data at the end is very important. That's the last step. So step one is unpack the image out of the XZ file. Step two, copy it to the internal of your phone after you did a formatting of the data. Step three, flash the image to the system partition. Step four, 
after the, that is done, go to Manage Partitions and change data to F to FS. And step five, format data and reboot. You're done. You successfully installed Android 14 to your Samsung A405F. It's well known as the A40. And there we are, <coughs> we arrived. And this is the very latest build. This was created yesterday or today. Yesterday. Very nice dark setup. This room should work fine. Although, um, one thing is not working, and that is the camera. So if you're depending on camera, this room is not for you, okay? I don't depend on camera, and the first thing that I do is I hit App Info, and I disable the app, and it was not running, so that's just fine. So this thing camera is not working it cannot look at you okay it cannot make pictures from you it cannot do anything because the camera is not working if they if anyone would try then the thing is gonna stock up completely and then your phone will reboot so yeah mission failed here we have internet and that works so let's connect to the internet. Okay, we're connecting and we are connected. So uh, in my case, oh, PH Treble app stopped and that is because we are not rooted. So in fact, you should as well, well, you should not, you don't have to. Here you have some Samsung features. Display, wallpaper. I don't see anything about camera, maybe here. Samsung features, miss features. Always cancel. Set rounded corners. Yeah, I don't really know. Only thing I know is that this is a good build. Okay, you can uh, yeah, you can check it out yourself. Full screen gestures. Let's go on the internet. Get the store. Hey, I don't want to log on with the account now because my accounts are a little bit difficult to log on to. Um, but you can log on with your account, it's not a problem. It's not a problem at all. Let's go to my downloads with files. And here she is. Open. We get in as anonymous. Updates. 
So you can start updating. Certain things will not update, they will only update via the Play Store. But this is the way how you can easily get the application really fast, you know. So, um, yeah, what can I say? It's, it works. And uh, we must credit Ponces for this build. Okay, even though the camera is not working, I think this is a great uh, privacy. Uh yeah, you can see it's by Ponces. You see that? So, yeah, that is it. It looks, uh, it looks pretty good. It feels smooth on the A40 um, phone. We have all sorts of numbers there, so that as well works. Um, yeah, you shouldn't expect too much from uh, from this, I mean, like... This is just for testing Bluetooth. You can check and see if Bluetooth works. Mm, connected devices, pair a new device. Yes, Bluetooth is working fine. So yeah, I don't miss the camera, honestly. I love the fact that this thing has no camera. So I think this is a great GSI for this phone. This is a phone that you can bring with you wherever you go. You know, I'm um, not sure if you can. Let me see, can you block the microphone? Let me see if it's hidden there. Location is off. That team. No. So you don't find that in AOSP, but how you can still get it is by going to about the files, hit the build number. Sorry for that. We go one back. We go to system, we go to no, to developers options. Oh. Am I crazy or what? About. Okay, I did not enable it yet. And here it is, developers options. And you just go to quick settings here and you turn on sensors off yeah now the thing cannot listen to you anymore microphone is not working microphone is disabled so yeah um nice are the gadgets working the widgets the clock widget is it working and hold no the widgets are not working on the a40 so that is a pity for some of you there as well not so much widgets i don't use these things you know all taking all that space on your on your desktop here let's chat so no um gadgets don't work the widgets don't work um but for the rest everything works widgets and camera is not working but hey you are running android 14 on your device not many people can say that and you now learned how to install it the right way the right and correct way and as you can see, the thing is nice, running and up. Bluetooth works, sound works, Wi-Fi works, phone works. Yeah, that's more than enough. What more do you want? Camera, yeah, 
then you must stay on official or install Android 13 or so because I could not find a good GSI with a working camera even though one of my subscribers said that his camera was working he found another uh, build and that it was working for him I could not find that build okay all the builds have a broken camera or camera is not being recognized I don't know it's talking up the complete device so you know you can try footage camera we can try it immediately <laughs> why not why not let's try it then we know maybe some people want to make film video but I don't think it's gonna work it has to do with it has to do with uh, with hardware sensor open camera where's footage did I write it wrong I don't see what I unfortunately let's try the camera from Mark Harmon might as well not work I think I tried this before but I cannot remember open if it stocks up forgive me failed to open cam camera maybe in use by another application okay that is possible it's been in use by sensors sensors off so let's see if it works now no immediately close it otherwise it's gonna stock up the complete system and reboot that sucks so that is not working uh, hey what happened over over oh it still stocks up <laughs> even though we closed the app so don't try the camera okay don't try to install a camera yeah this is yeah proven now that if you touch the camera it's gonna stock up and then it will reboot <laughs> yeah so that is a little issue with this GSI but maybe Ponces can fix it in the next build so I want to say thank you Ponces great job for now okay it's working and uh, yeah we have the latest build so I did not check the security patch uh, level probably it's still at July I don't know strange yes I it has uh, latest Android but the security patch level was not I don't know maybe it's updated I did not check but you can do that okay my friends so that is how to install Android 14 on your a40 uh, model a405f good job